all right guys welcome to sparky graphics training today quickly i'll be showing you how to design a simple logo using your canva so without wasting time we move over to our canva so we tap on canva and then we'll give you some time to load canva actually takes time because of data it uses data but if your network is very fast your canva wouldn't waste time loading okay so we'll just wait for our canva to load so that we can actually start um designing the logo so once again, this is Sparky Graphics training. What we are undergoing now is the free training. After the free training, we move into the advanced class, which is two weeks for two weeks. And then in the advanced class, you'll be taught on how to design more um, crazy designs and interesting designs, and also how to sell your designs, okay? The advanced class is basically, you pay a very cheap token, okay? Affordable one, which is not even compared to what you benefit when you actually register for the advanced class so when the canva actually opens so you wait for the canva to load completely now after the canva has done loading so you just wait for it so that we can actually select what we want to work with okay canva takes time to load so we'll just give it some time and allow it to load so we can work with what we want Just give you some time to load. This you can do this design with your Pixel app, which does not require data. But this is for those that cannot download um, Pixel app, like the iPhone users, and for those that cannot use Pixel app. So that is why we are actually using Canva here to show you how to design a very simple logo. So we we'll just wait for it to load. So once it's done loading. Because there are lots of content on Canva, so that's why it's always taking time. So we'll click on the plus sign, tap on the plus sign, and then once you tap on the plus sign, the next thing that will happen is you click on logo. You see logo here, you tap on logo size. That's for the size, you tap on logo. Okay. So you wait for it to load. Once it's downloading, we're actually going to look for what we want to use for our design, what we want to use for our logo design. So, let's wait for the working page to load completely so that it can actually start working. So, once, let's wait for it to load well. So, you wait for it to load so that you can start designing. Always ensure that you have a steady data so that you can actually work fast with your Canva. All this is because my network is not really steady, stable. That's why it's just um, wasting much time like this. So you wait for it to look completely so that you can start designing. Just wait for it to load. So, once the working page is ready and set so that we can start our design, we just move over to, to get a template of what we want to actually use to design. So, we we'll move over to our Chrome browser. Okay, you move to our Chrome browser. And then we search for flat icon. Search for flat icon. Flat icon. You should search for it. Wait for the site to open. 
this is where you actually get icons then you tap on this point wait for it to go to the can actually get so you search for the icons that you want so for now we'll be working with a beauty icon for instance you are designing a logo simple logo for a beauty salon so you just search for beauty and then you search you can search for anything if it's a um a restaurant a cooking business or any any stuff you want you just search for it so we just search for what we want for beauty so we search for icons beauty icons okay search for beauty icons then you search there will be lots of templates about 89,953 beauty icons so you wait for it to actually load so that you can select the ones you want to work with so we just wait for it to load you be patient with it okay then okay we we'll actually select the ones you want so i'll just go with anyone any 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 one of my choice so i'll just tap on this okay Tap on it and then download image. That's what I want to use with my design. So once I'm done with that, the next thing I have to do is what we'll go over to remove.bg. I want to remove the background from what I just downloaded. Remove.bg. You can download any design you want. And then you search. Remove.bg. You wait for it to load. So I can actually select what you want to. So tap on upload image. Tap on upload image. So you select the image I just downloaded, click done, so it will be uploaded and then the background will be removed completely. So you can see the background has been removed, so we download, tap on download. And then you download it, so it, the stuff has been downloaded. So it's done. So we minimize, go back to our Canva and then start our work. So we go back to our Canva. But to Canva, you wait for it to load. So, what we want to work with now, you go to gallery, tap on gallery, tap on gallery so that we can actually do what, um, start our work. So you wait for it to load. Wait for the images from gallery to load. There you can actually study what you want to um, use for our design. So I'll just use that um, icon that I downloaded from Flat Icon. So you can actually use any one. So I'll use this. You can download anything. So I'll just tap on it. Okay. Then add to page. Tap on, click on add to page. Click on add to page. Sorry, that was not what I wanted. So I'll delete it. Click on the plus sign. Okay. Click on the plus sign. <laughs> And then click on gallery. So I'll just select that stuff that I downloaded. So I tap on it. Tap on it. Add to page. Click 
click on add to page so it can actually be added to my page so i can start the work so now wait for it to be added to page okay then you can increase the size then once you increase the size we now do what drag it up a little bit kick it up take it up and then you are good to go so the next thing we have to do is we need to add color to this okay you can decide to add color to your design you can also decide to leave it that way so once you are done with that the next thing we have to do is what we need to write the text okay so we click on the plus sign go to text tap on text okay tap on text then you wait for fonts to load so tap on text give you some time and wait for it to load so that i can actually write what we want to write so we click on add heading So we bring it down, bring it down. This is where you want it to be, and then you want it to be down. Bring it down. Okay. So the next thing we have to do is what edit. So we click on edit. We want to edit that text. We want to write our text. So we delete this out, and then we add the text we want to use. I want to use Sparky's Beauty. So that's the name of the beauty salon. Sparky's Beauty. Okay, Sparky's Beauty. You can see I'm done with that. So, I'm good to go. So, the next thing is you can actually also reduce the size of this stuff. If you want to reduce the size, you can see font size. But I like the font. I like the size here. Let me make it 35. 36. Let's make it 36. And then we are good to go. So now, the next thing I have to do is let me add color to my text. So I'll go to color, scroll down, click on color, tap on color, and then I'll select the color I want to use for the text. I want to use this color for my text. Okay, good to go. So now we are done, we're almost done. So we need to select a nice color for our background. So we tap on background, select color, and then just choose a nice background for our, of our design. Let's use yellow. Okay, so you can see. So now with this, we are done designing a very simple logo for Sparky's Beauty. You can actually design anything you want. Just go to flat icon and then import your design. And then download the icon that you want to use either cooking fashion anyone so once you're done with this you tap on this point to download tap on that point then you click on download and then you wait for your design to prepare to download and then you download it it's preparing your design for download Wait for it to prepare completely for download. Wait for it to prepare completely for download. Just wait for it. So that's how to design a simple logo using your Canva. Just go over to that icon, search for any any icon you want, and use it for your design. So you can make anything you want with this sample. Choose what you want, even if it's a barbing stuff, cooking stuff, anyone, fashion. So you just search for anyone you want and then you do what? Use it for your design. And then come up with lots of stuff. Choose your background and then you can make your design very simple. You don't need to make some logos, you don't need to make it complex. Just add one or two things and then you are good to go. So you just come down and wait for your design to actually prepare completely. Be patient for it. 
and once it's done preparing all you have to do is just click on download and then your design is downloaded straight to your gallery so it seems it's taking too much time to prepare but once everything is set just click on this point that is cancel here when everything has set this point you change to download then you tap on download and do what download your design thank you very much for watching this video see you